All right, we are checking out Nico Nico. Can you explain a bit about Nico Nico for those of us who may not be as hip to Japanese video sites? Of course. Nico Nico Doga is your basically your YouTube equivalent in Japan. It's very, very popular. It's got videos, it's got live streams, it's got all sorts of it, it's kind of otaku ish in that uh, it's it's a lot of stuff about anime and video games. Um, so let me see if I can find a nice video for you guys to look at. Uh, like I said, it is otaku, so I might have to be a little <coughs> picky about which videos to show you, but uh, Pokemon seems safe. It's so meta, we're watching a Pokemon video on a PlayStation device. <laughs> the universe is going to implode now. It's working. It's loading. It's loading. So this, is so this is like the crazy stuff about um, Nico Nico. It lets people comment in the stream. You can turn that off, of course, but uh, it just kind of streams across the screen as, as you watch. Anyway, let's uh, stop that. We can get out of there. Um, it's not implemented yet, but um, in the future, they're supposed to be allowing uh, direct uploads from your Vita as well as live streaming from your Vita. So that's kind of an interesting feature. Kind of cool, uh, you know, you're out at an event or something and, and you can just stream it. That's pretty cool. I wonder if they're, um, that we'll see something like that similar with uh, YouTube functionality. Yeah, I'll, I'll um, bet there'll be something like similar to this for uh, YouTube or you know some other streaming site on, on the U.S. version. I have to admit the notion of people being able to live comment from their Vitas watching stuff on YouTube terrifies me. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, basically that's it. Uh, you can you know of course search and do all that crazy stuff, rankings, uh, all that. But um, essentially that's it for this app. Cool. Well, thank you for the rundown, and be sure to check out our other PlayStation Vita launch videos on GamesRadar.com.